Now that we set up our user groups and connected to our database, we're ready to start building out the pages that we're gonna need for this client portal. So already we have our home page here and I'm just gonna go into settings, go to general, and I'm just gonna name this our dashboard page, okay? And then under this, I can also go down to visibility and I can show who I want to be able to access this page. And in this case, only logged in users should be able to get access to the dashboard page but we will allow both clients and admins to view that. So that's all good there. I'm gonna hit save, okay? Now after the dashboard page, we wanna create a project page. So add new, I'm gonna say projects, save. All right, now we're on this blank project page, which is good. And I'm gonna to go to the settings page again, and I'm gonna go into, sorry, the visibility. And again, this should only be for logged in users. So projects is completed. Now I wanna bring projects below the dashboard, so I'm just gonna hold it and drag it below there. Now after projects, I gotta create that project detail page because I'm gonna have a list of projects here, and then I wanna be able to click into that list to see one specific project and all the details. So it's gonna be project details. Now on the project detail page, I'm gonna do repetitive stuff here. I'm gonna make sure it's only for logged in users. That's good, and I'm going to bring it below our projects there. Excellent. I'm gonna create a tasks page. Same thing here. We're gonna visibility, only logged in users, save, and drag below our project details page right there. And we're gonna have our clients page. Clients. Same thing, you could fast forward if you don't wanna see me making all these little things. It's all the same though. Then boom, 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 boom. There we go. Now it's going to be client detail page. So that way we can see the details for each of our clients. Logged in. Right. Client details. Now the last page is our invoices page. Invoices. Right. And again, sorry about that. Invoices, settings, visibility, logged in user, boom. And I'm just gonna bring this all the way down there. And then I have created all of my pages now. So I've created all of my pages now and I have this structure set up, which is great. And I actually wanna go to the top left corner, click on entitled application. And this is gonna be the client portal. And I'm gonna say build along because that's what we're building together. But you can just say client portal on your behalf. Uh, and there we go, we have our application. It has the pages that we need for our build so far. It has been connected to our data source. We have our users, our user groups. And in the next lesson, we're gonna be setting up our themes together. So we just start to bring together all of our custom colors, our font choices and everything that you set up once and will then be applied everywhere in the application. So I'll see you there.